Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Into the Breach. Finished off last episode with uh, securing this island and looking through the shop. Now, let, let me show you what I have. Let me just first give you the lowdown. Um, each one of these, these two, are both kind of like already fully stocked with weapons. I haven't used the little rock launcher that much. I haven't used the smoke all that much. This guy is missing one weapon and I'm thinking, I'm looking at him and thinking, he's the weakest. He might be the one that he should probably be the one to get the most... Uh, the most, uh, da -da. what was I, what was I gonna say? Like extra, uh, he should be the one to get any resources. And I'm looking at this plus two damage and thinking that would be really, really cool. Would it come at expense of immune buildings or extra movement? I haven't decided yet. So let's have a look at our weapons. First off, this is a science class weapon. We can't actually use this at all. We don't have a matching mech. So there's a science class mech that we haven't seen yet. This is cool, freezing yourself and all the Jason tiles. Uh, it takes a lot of power, and I can see this being really useful for like, kind of like a last ditch attempt at protect everything. Just throw yourselves into the midst of battle and defend against it. Um, this is looking cool. I like the fact that you, it rams. Unfortunately, you do take one damage to yourself, and by looking at the upgrades with the required power, it takes... You can upgrade it once to do extra damage to yourself and the enemy, so doing three damage and taking two damage, that's already kind of harsh. It means this guy would have to really spec into a lot of health, which is, I'm not feeling too keen about that. Mm, and it takes three power in order to just do three damage and one self damage, so I'm not, not a huge fan. This is interesting. This is a nuke. You can only use it once per battle, and using two bow, you can do an extra one use. Uh, that said, it does four damage. Could be five with extra power. But I'm not liking it. Even though I haven't really used the rock, I, I, I want to wish the rock comes comes by. So anyways, I'm thinking instead, getting two reactor cores to start. And these two reactor cores will go to my artillery mech. Do I remove the movement and give him... Oh, install, install. I give him an extra two damage, or do I remove the immune Im building immunity? See, that's the thing. With two extra damage, that's going to be doing. If I have to shoot a building to spread enemies apart, I'm going to do. I'm just yeah. That's 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 hard. That's hard. So anyway, this guy suddenly has the highest DPS. Whoever he shoots is going to really feel it, and I think removing the one movement is worth it because I'm scared about the buildings. Yeah, I'm happy with that. With my final two power, or with my two reputation, like, I'm just... Would having this nuke available be handy? I like ramming better. This is, um... Maybe get one grid power and one... Ice uh, I can't use the ice generator, but the reputation will be gone anyway, so let's do, yeah. One group power, one ice generator. I mean, I don't need- uh... What's worth more, grid power or like the ramming? I think the ramming is more useful. It's just, it'll be good to have, potentially, like, uh, yeah. But I already attack at range, who cares? I don't need it. So then take- Screw it. Just, yeah, fight me. Oh! Okay. I'm... Okay. Anyways, that's four minutes of just trying to make up my mind. By completing three islands, I've unlocked Detri Detritus Disposal. Future games, yada, yada, yada. I see. Detritus tech can break down any matter into its base elements. The factory cities are devoted to waste removal and recycling. Uh, and looking down below, we have some standard enemies, the scorpions, the scarabs, and the fireflies, not fireflies, but the flying types. We have a new scion soldier by the looks of it, and two new... What is that leader? What the hell? I've never seen that. Let's jump right in. When the vec came, to try this to... Okay, to try this to go on what refugees we could. What we lack is your military expertise, commander. Fair enough. See, double power, or... I'm thinking here, here, like here and here. I like that route. But first, let me alt-tab to make sure that I am indeed recording. 
So let's start this. Conveyor belts. Warning. So Vector are detected to kill at least seven. Eugh. Or pr and protect the clinic. I see that is the conveyor belts. Belts. According to our projections, we must exterminate all the Vec in this sector. None can remain alive and none must escape. You're not telling me to kill literally all of them. You're just telling me to kill seven. Unless only seven spawn. I'd be happy if only seven spawned. Uh, so yeah, I'm happy with the damage. Damage, like, build layouts. Don't know how conveyor belts work. And there's the clinic. This tile will push any unit in the direction marked on this belt. Is it just once or is it multiple? Inflicts acid on the first unit that steps on this space. And what does acid do? <laughs> Presumably only one damage. Okay, let's see. We have... Alpha Spider. Oh, 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 this is what this guy does. Um, passive effect, all other Vec heal one at the start of their turn. Oh, that is disgusting, I hate that. Um, throw a sticky egg that hatches into... Oh, no! So it's sticky, and then it hatches a spiderling. Gosh, and it, it's all around. Okay, that's scary. Alpha Scarab. Why, okay, why do I have so many alphas? That does three damage. That does no damage. It's just sticky. That This guy will do two damage. Slam against three tiles. Oh, yuck. In a row. This fake will hide underground after taking one or more damage. The, and stable. Cannot be moved or pushed. Yikes. Okay, so that means artillery will just peg him, I feel. Okay, um... I, I don't like anyone starting here because you have to move. This is where all my units will start. Okay, so I will be killing the Scion. I'll kill the Scion first and have to focus the Alpha Spider as well, which I'm thinking of doing by simply having a cannon shoot him into the acid and then pegging him with my... Oh, uh, look, they'll be moving around and I think having everyone here to start... makes the most sense. I forgot it. I, I didn't see how. Okay, you're gonna move right. It's inflicted with acid with its defenses corroded. Incoming weapon damage will be doubled. Holy crap. I can kill in one shot using my artillery. All other damage is unaffected. So look, um... Okay. So let me... That'll do four damage. I can... That'll do six. That'll kill him. And push him into me. Um, that's bad. Oh, that's really bad. Uh, this guy can... Can, like, shoot over here and kill this dude easily and quick. So if I kill this guy, kill this guy... And then... I have to take care of this guy somehow. This guy absolutely needs to die using my artillery. And if I do it with artillery, it'll free him. And he only has how much movement? Four. So it'll be here. It'll be like one, two, three, four. Oh no, but I can dash punch and then I can like wait here. Perfect. <laughs> so, uh, you move over to here to kill this dude. I have to move him out of the way so that when I shoot this guy with the artillery and this guy gets pushed, there's a free space. He doesn't take any damage. Wait, this is the clinic here. I kill at least seven enemies. Okay. Bang. Too easy. Far too easy. You will stay here. And shoot like this. And that frees me. You're not attacking. I can move you over to here and... Hold on. What is this? Will it die as soon as it hatches? I, I'm, I'm not entirely sure what's going on with... And that'll move you back and you'll shoot into here. Um, when... What is the attack order environment? I guess that's movement, right? That's... This is environment. Movement. Okay. Um, ba 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 Uh, dooka 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 dooka. And then... Punch him... Over to there. Yes, and that will all be fine. And I can stay here, or... Uh, yeah, I'll stay here. 
and end my turn. Okay. So you only move the one unit. You don't like follow all the way to the end. Oh, you bugger. It's okay. You're dead one way or another. Okay, let me work this out. Two units are attacking this building, so I need to kill one and two. I can kill this one easily. This one's attacking the clinic. The clinic is the most important. I am I think I'm okay with taking one grid damage, truth be told, but... I can kill this guy using him. So maybe I should be taking out the alpha spider as soon as possible. So this guy can be killed using him. Either one of these guys can be killed using the combat mech. But then I'm stuck and I can't... Like, I'd, I'd have to kill... Or I have to... Um... Unless I can, like... The spiders will be easy to kill, won't they? See, I'm just, I don't want to walk through the acid. And I could shoot that as well. Oh, Jesus, this is bad. I'm having a lot of enemy spawn. That's bad. Um, this guy is stuck one way or another, so he will shoot her. I don't want to go through the acid, but... Because I'm thinking, let the spider attack that place. I'd rather... Wait, hold on, when did the environment stuff happen? Because will that just get pushed out of the way, the spider? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Conveyors, conveyor belts will push any units. At the start of the enemy turn. Is that the start of the attacking turn? Okay, hold on, let me get out my phone. Let me, I need to Google this really quick. <laughs> because I'm, oh gosh, my phone's low on battery. Into the breach. Conveyor. I misspelt it as conseil. I can a belt. Let's see. Come on, give me the notes. No trivia. What? Hello? Like, what? This article is a stub. It's at the start of the enemy turn. That, that's all I know. Is that like the start of the attacking turn? Or is it like fire? Or is it at the start of their moving turn? No, 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 it's at the start of their moving turn. God damn it. So I will take the one grid defense, a uh, grid power, a uh, grid damage. I have an 18% chance of defending it, however, so that's useful. Let me, hold on, where's my clock, where's my timer? There it is. 15 minutes of nothing. Okay, meaning, I've made up my mind. This guy, he's already shot. <laughs> you will have to kill this one, and you will kill this dude, and then move back to, the, to prevent another spawn, because I'm going to have way too many spider hatchlings. Just wreck, wrecking havoc. God dang it! I should, I should have, I should have been smarter with how I played this. I should have killed the spider woman first. So you're dead. You move over to here and you punch, and then you come back to here, and then end turn. Oh wait, I didn't. Yes. Oh, balls. Is that an asset? Oh, you're an idiot. I can kill him in one turn again. This guy's gonna die unless I can heal up. Oh, you can't do anything. You're stuck there. 
Oh, I can take that one damage. I can tank it. So I can just... Wait, hold on. Who attacks... So I can kill him in one turn like that, using my artillery. Uh, and then... I guess... I kill this here, and... I move him here so that at least if you want to attack him one approach is through the acid mm -hmm. okay uh, that leaves victory in two turns with so many small spider I have one two soon to be three spiders this guy can't do anything thankfully um, but you need to Because so what I'm kind of looking at doing is, this guy shoots. Some oh no, that'll kill him. But that means if I punch, that'll do damage to me. Oh my god! So it moves just like. I, I guess heal up, kill the spider queen, and heal up and take one grid damage. That might be defended. Oh, nope, nope, nope. It's on a conveyor. Oh, perfect. Oh, so perfect. So perfect. Okay, so just kill the spider queen. And you will self-repair. I need to self-repair because enemies are going to spawn underneath. And that'll be very annoying. And then I'll have three spiders to take care, take care of. One, two. Yeah, three spiders to take care of. And another three standard enemies. Oh my god. That's way too much. So end turn. Perfect, perfect, perfect. You have been born. You are blocked. Oh, flies and scorpions. Ah. Oh, no. Don't do it like this. Don't do me dirty. And they're alphas as well, so I can't just... Frent it. Um, flying units are also impacted by... <laughs> oh my god, that's doing so much damage. So the flying unit's gonna miss. That's taken care of. This guy's attacking me, this guy's attacking me. I only need to worry with this guy. So, okay, you need to be worried about it. This one. This one, because it's going to kill my unit. I can ignore this guy, can't I? No way. That is so cool. Um, so there are three units to be worried about. I, I think I guess I could ignore this unit. If I kill this unit, I should be able to like I should be able to move this guy one, two, three, four over to here and kill this guy, save my own unit and still take that one grid damage. Shoot. Um. Oh wait, no, I can just punch and move again, can't I? With this. Right? I can punch the move. God damn it, no I can't. It has to be like... I have to move him away, he's, he's sort of stuck there. Um... Because I don't actually have to kill this guy. I need only to move him. Because, like, I could do something like this. No, see, that'll kill me. Oh, undo move. So move him out of the way like that. But ultimately, I'm very unsatisfied. Because I'm still taking one grid damage. Do I want to reset turn? You know what? It's one grid damage.
It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. The one grid. Oh, oh! Yeah! Yeah! This building resisted damage. The chance of a building resistant damage is shown that, the, yeah. Just awesome. Okay, finally that's happened. He whiffed. Did a lot of damage, yes, but... Hold on, wasn't I, wasn't I supposed to kill six? I did kill six. Oh my god. I mean seven. Wow, I, I completely lost track of how many I was supposed to kill. Hew, 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 hew. That was very lucky. Anyways, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned. Going to be... Oh, going to be some really hard missions coming in the future. The difficulty has really ramped up. So hey, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. See you next time. Bye!